Hello, welcome to this video on how to access your home learning. So first of all, go to www.office.com to access the Office Teams and then click on the link here where it says sign in. Using the details that your child teacher has provided, log them on with their username and password. Once you have logged on, you'll be taken to the main Office 365 screen. In order to access the home learning, you want to click on the Teams icon down the bottom here. Once in Teams, you will see the class your child has been assigned to. You can see here this, this child has been assigned to 4A, so I'll click on the 4A. This bit takes me to the main Teams page for 4A. At the top here, you can see it says Assignments, and I'm going to click on that. And this will take me through to the home learning for your child. So you can see here under Assigned, there's a piece of work on generalizers that's due in tomorrow. So if I click on this work, so this is the main screen for this piece of work on generalizers. You've got two main sections, reference materials and my work. The reference materials are information that will be provided by your teacher to help with the child's learning. Here, for example, there is a PowerPoint with the slides your child needs for the information and a video link as well to YouTube that will take you to a video all about this PowerPoint. So if I click on the PowerPoint, you can see on the PowerPoint here, these are all the slides your child will need for their learning. As I said, there may be other links, there may be video links, there may be links to other websites, there may be uh, picture files are included, but everything under reference is to help your child with their learning. Under my work, this is where the child actually does their work. So you can see here, the teacher has already added a Word document called Generalizers. This is for your child to put their work on. So if they click on this link, this will take them to the Word document and they can then uh, edit this Word document straight from the device you're on. There is no need to download it. They can work on it straight away. So I've read the information and now I'm ready to put some work down. So I might write my first sentence such as, sometimes the boy falls over. Okay. So then when I click over here to close, the document closes down. But if I then click on generalizers again, you will see that the information has been saved. Everything that's been written. There's no need to hit any save buttons. It automatically saves as you work. So I've done some work now. I could hand it into a teacher. However, I have got this other option here to add work. So if you don't want to do the work online, you prefer instead to do it on paper or you do it on a different document, then you can use these for this one. So what I do is if I click on add work, I can click on a new file here that would allow me to add a new Word document, a new PowerPoint, a new Excel, or a new OneNote note page. If I click on any of these, I could then create a new document, I could put my work on it, and then this will then be saved as part of this assignment that could be sent to a, the teacher. You also have below here, up, upload from this device. This means if you've done some work on paper and photographed it and you want to upload it straight from that, then you can do that. So once you've got all your work that you want to, the child wants to assign to the teacher and hand back to them, and everything's finished, they click on this button over here that says hand in. Once you get the snazzy little uh, video that pops up here, this means that the work has been sent to your teacher for them to have a look at. If afterwards your child realizes they wanted to change something, they can click undo hand in over here and they can once again access the work over here. And when they're finished, click hand in and they can just keep doing that. There is no deadline for that being finished. So that is how your work is accessed in assignments. You can go back to here. And then you'll see there's nothing in assigned, but incompleted the generalizers has been done down here. OK, and every day you will be assigned work by your teacher, which will be in this assigned section over here. Well, thank you for watching the video. And if you have any co comments or concerns about how to access this work, please contact your class teacher. Thank you.